Hey, I'm in your face today. Yeah. So summer has almost officially started and I am super excited. You have no idea. Um, and I thought it'd be really cool if I just went through a few of like, well, let's say, let's say like 10. Okay. My top 10 things to get ready for summer. Here we go. So my number one tip would be to have a beach body. I don't know what you're thinking. You're like, oh crap, that's one of those videos that tell me that I'm not fit enough. Nah, -uh, no girlfriend, no way. Having a beach body isn't a certain shape or size. It is literally just having a body and then going to the beach. Uh, my number two thing would be exercise. And I know, again, you're like, really, exercise? Ugh. Like, tell me something I don't know. That's groundbreaking, Sienna. No, I want you to exercise because you love your body, not because you hate it. I want you to exercise to feel good, not to look good. Damn, girl, that's a little muscle there. <laughs> Number three is hydration. So obviously drinking lots of water because summertime means you're gonna be like outdoors a lot more, probably sweating because it gets super hot. Um, and you need to replace the, the kind of the vital fluids and the hydration that you're losing. So drinking lots of water, if you infuse your water with fruit or like lemon and mint or something like that, it makes it even yummier. So just a little tip there. My number four tip is to eat more plants. Eat like an abundance of fruit and veg. Anything that's natural, um, doesn't have preservatives, uh, isn't like processed, anything that doesn't have a lot of sugar in it, anything that's natural. Number five would be getting some swimmers or something you can wear in the water uh, that you feel comfortable in. So it could be a bikini. It could be a, it could be board shorts, it could be a rash shirt, it could be tights even. You don't have to wear the typical bikinis or, or one piece. You can wear whatever you want. As long as you feel comfortable, then go for it. You can wear a coat if you can swim in it. I mean, probably don't wear it if you can't swim in it because we don't want you to drown. Number six is sunscreen and sun safety. So especially in Australia, our sun and our UV is super, super strong. So if you go out there for like, I don't know, an hour or two, or depending on your skin type, you'll just like sizzle. Yeah. Wear sun, uh, sunnies to protect your eyes and hats to protect your face because your face is super, super sensitive. Wear t-shirts to cover up your shoulders. And depending on the sunscreen that you can get, you can either get like 30 or 50, preferably get a 50, um, just because it, it, is, it is obviously a higher protection. And then make sure that if you go in the water, and even if you're not going in the water, you need to reapply. So number seven would be an epic playlist and speaker. Something that like just pretty much exudes summer. So you hear it and you're like, yes, it is summer. Welcome sunshine. I love life. Number eight, of course, duh, is a camera. Cause you wanna be able to catch all of this awesomeness that you're gonna be doing over the summer. So either whether it be like a GoPro, or even just your phone, whether you have like a proper camera or a DSLR, a little vlogging camera, anything that you can grab a quick snap on is perfect. So I always have a disposable camera in my handbag now because I just love having that with me. Um, and I only take like one or two photos every time I get it out, except then I feel like when I go and get developed, I'll remember all these past memories. So maybe that's something you want to do, maybe it's not, I don't know. Feel free to do it. I'm not trademarking it, go for it. <laughs> number nine would be, number nine? Number nine, number nine. Be your own squad goals. So instead of looking on the screen and being like, oh my God, like squad goals, wish I could hang out with those people. Go make your own squad goals. And number 10, of course, it wouldn't be summer without. Drum roll, please. Ding! I know they say like, that money can't buy happiness, but it can buy get floaty inflatables. <laughs> and they're pretty much the same thing. <laughs> so I've got like swans, I've got shells, I've got unicorns, and we're about to go and pump them all up. We're gonna go have the best day ever. I'm so excited. <laughs> so those are my top 10 tips on how to have the most epic summer ever. And in celebration of this video and of the, cut, the, the summer that is, um, we're gonna go and have some fun. <laughs> You wanna come? Go on.
que 